This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you slap a like on this for me. Well, we got some beef going on between YG and legendary DJ Quick from the West Coast. It's all over the song My Hitta with Jeezy and uh, Rich Homie Quan. And basically, Quick is upset because he didn't get his credit on the album for being the engineer of the session. And it was done in his studio. And he wants his plaque or he is suing. Now, if you don't know who DJ Quick is, he is a legend out of Compton, out in California. Been doing it since 1990. Used to be down with Easy E, Ruthless Records. You know, you know Easy E from NWA. If you saw that movie, you know he came out with Second to None. Quick is the name. You know, and he's produced for you know Tupac, All Eyes on Me, uh, Jermaine Dupri, Life in 1472, TQ. Uh, Shaquille O'Neal, when he was a rapper, Snoop Dogg, Adina Howard, just to name a few. So this guy is a legend and basically pioneered the the sound you hear today coming from uh, DJ Mustard and everybody. He pioneered that West Coast sound in the 90s. That's, that was his, and he's also a huge DJ. He's won awards. Look him up. Anyways. I guess he produced this, well, he didn't produce the song, cause, but he did record the song, My Hitta, and he's basically kind of like threatening YG in a, in a sense by saying, you know, be safe on the block I invented, I want my credit, you know, so basically he's saying he, he engineered it, the lawyer's about to like sue YG because he didn't get his credit and he wants a plaque, you know. And then he's like kind of playing on the – remember when Snoop Dogg got up uh, during like the Source Awards or whatever and there he was like, oh, you don't got love for, for Death Row and, uh, and uh, Snoop Doggy Dog? Well, he's saying, you don't fuck with DJ Quick. He's saying all this on Twitter towards YG. Then uh, he shot a, a tweet at, YG, uh, at Jeezy and YG saying, uh, shoot me engineering credits uh, for recording the vocals on your platinum song, My Hitta. Or whatever you call it. Then he said, wake up and respond tomorrow in the timeline. We are all waiting. Then YG finally responds and says, fuck the police at DJ Quick. And basically, uh, you know, references his tweets. You'll see. Guess what Compton rapper I'm about to sue. So this is all. This is like such a petty beef. I don't know what made DJ Quick. Maybe he just doesn't feel like he's getting the respect that he deserves for pioneering such a sound and being part of that record. But I wonder what made him wake up today and be so mad about this. Like something else had to go on. Maybe he made a phone call just trying to inquire about it. And maybe someone just shut him down at the label. And he feels, you know, sometimes the only way to get someone's attention is to bring it to their doorstep or make them respond. You know, like as you see 50 Cent do often. But, uh, yeah, hopefully they can resolve this. This seems like such a petty beef, you know, and, you know, hopefully they can resolve this quickly, you know, and not go through a lawsuit. I'm sure he just wants his credit and he just wants his plaque. I mean, it's a simple resolution here. Uh, YG might have too much pride and not want to want to do that but you know these guys are both from compton and you know la is small you don't want to have problems with people so hopefully they can resolve this amicably and just be done with it because it seems really stupid but i'm just reporting on it let me know what you guys think in the comments should yg give him his credit does he deserve his credit i mean everybody else gets their credit something slipped through the cracks here and especially why would you do that to such a legend dj quick anyways Signing off.